Hi, I'm Seamus Laffin. I'm in the Kerry Chagas Giant program for the last four years. Um, we've had a big focus on soil fertility here. Um, we've been soil sampling every year for the last four years and we're using the colour coded maps and we're targeting certain paddocks for that are low on P and K and targeting them with extra P and K that is needed. Um, about 90% of the farm is now okay for P and pH is also fairly good. We've um, spread about 140 tonnes of lime again this year, um, correcting some of the lower ones and some ground that we receded. Since we started the programme, I just kind of started measuring grass at that stage and now I'm kind of completing about 35 grass walks each year. And um, we, we use, I find this very good in the spring, especially to know what grass is out on the farm and you can get out earlier and uh, you have more confidence in what you have there, so it's just easier um, to, to go out and another time you mightn't go out if, if you didn't think you had enough grass. But now you have the figures kind of back you up and it gives you more confidence. And um, throughout the year it's handy in for taking out paddocks and stuff, you have more confidence again knowing when, that you can do it out some ground. Currently there's, well, after having a lot of rain over the last few weeks, um, cows are still out day and night full time. Um, getting about three kilos a meal at the minute. Um, we did a good bit of work on the infrastructure on the farm. It's a big benefit now at the, at, in, in times like this. Um, we can get on and off areas without, um, without doing damage. We, um, we can get on and off without crossing back over ground that we've already grazed. And it's, it's, it's really helping at the minute now with getting through heavy cover. We hope now to reach our target of closing 60% by the 1st of November. Since May we increased our area here, we took on an extra 5 hectare block alongside us. It needed a good bit of work and we put in about 500 metres of a roadway. We defence it all and um, we receded half of it. We put in a monoculture abergain. We find it very good, it's grown very well all year, but it needs to be grazed fairly regularly and we kept going into it every 16 days and a year that keep on top of it and it's still going away fairly well even now. And we have a spur road we're going through to do that to give good access to the whole lot of it. Yeah we since we moved in we've we did the roadway straight away and burned off half of it and received it. So if it's up and running now it should be really going well next year. Yeah we started when we started the program we had about milking about 70 cows here. We're now going up to 95 this year. Um, we got the extra five hectares I suppose but we haven't increased the meal, we are just we're growing more grass now with better fertility and the grass measurement is sort of helping to increase the yields and the paddocks so we have to support the higher stock in that.